Before we proceed, let's set up a static IP for our domain controller. So currently it is at 192.168.1.103 and uh, if you reboot the system, this could have another IP and especially for a domain controller, it is uh, recommended to have a static IP so all other systems can reach to it in, at any time. So changing the IP is um, pretty simple. So you can right click on this computer icon in the taskbar, click open network and sharing settings, click on this ethernet and go to properties, go to this IPv4, click on properties and you can say, you can specify the IP address here. We're going to use 192.168.1.103. And we can keep the subnet mask as 255.255.255.0 and the default gateway will be the same as of pfSense. If you recall our pfSense box is in the same network. So we, sh we are connecting all the machines to this LAN network. So the DNS server will also be the same as the pfSense box. So click OK and close this window. So let's open the server manager again to check and see if it is changed. So now you can see the Ethernet, the IP address is 192.168.1.200.